Parker is trying to run two operations with a crew of just eight and a secret weapon that he's been working on all season. Been in the works for over two months now, and uh, it's definitely going to be a huge money saver, reduce our labor bill, and streamline everything. I'm a little nervous. There's a lot of, a lot of money and steel in this thing. Looks like Seamus is already here with the truck. Rick and the boys are here, too. You made it! You said you had a conveyor to haul, Parker. Well, what the heck, man? That thing is huge. Yeah. You sure it's going to fit down the road? I don't know. That's your department. <laughs> Look, I've never hauled anything this long down these roads before. This will definitely be one of the bigger loads. The monster conveyor cost Parker $300,000. It does the work of three rock trucks and three men. A single operator in an excavator can send overburden directly out of the cut. But to do that, the self-propelled conveyor has to be 150 feet, almost half the length of a football field. Building a ramp here to load the excavator conveyor on the side of the trailer. We're going to come up and around, drive it on sideways. Parker said it weighs about 120,000 pounds. This is a 100 ton low bed, so we should be good. It looks like the San Francisco Bridge walking down the middle of the airstrip. <laughs> I'm not going to say it's the dumbest thing we've ever done, but uh, <laughs> it's going to be right up there. I love it. You're looking nervous. Like, that's a long-ass truck, and this thing's twice as long as it. I wonder what Seamus is thinking right now. What the <laughs> did I just commit to? <laughs> the scale of that is quite intimidating. It is a monster. 